Good day, Sri Ewan. My name is Jim, founder of JT Tekra Sanem Berhad. We are the LED display design manufacturer house. In front of us, this is a LED basketball scoreboard. Where I can see the size of the display is 1010mm for the width and the height is 370mm. So let's start our demonstration today. Where I can see this is the main controller come with a horn. So this main controller, basically there's four output. So there's a display output, score input, 24 second input, and also 10 minutes the timer input. So let's start our presentation today. This is the one-to-one -one K5 cable. You can see, this is the, the first one is the display output. So let's plug in. So once you plug in, okay, let's move the cable to behind. So plug in. Once you plug in, the next one will be the first keypad will be the score keypad. So this is the one-to-one -one cable. So let's plug it in over here. Plug in. Click. Then, let's put it here over first. Then plug into the score. So it light up. So same goes to 24 seconds. So this is a 24 seconds. Plug in, light up. And the last one will be the 10 minutes. So plug in, light up. So this is how it looks like. So we can see the scoreboard now is basically update from the keypad controller. The next part will be, let's start our on the keypad demonstration. So this is the score. So remember the button here, for the right, we added the score. And the left is the score. And the both meter is the fault. You can see fault four times and added the score. So once, if the operator is pressed, you can press and hold. You can minus one. Press and hold and minus one. For reset, press and hold. For more than three seconds, it will reset to zero. So this is how it looks like. So same goes to the score over here. Press and hold for more than five seconds, it will reset. So you can see already reset. So this is how it looks like for the scoring. So we can see in another features it can set the name. So press and hold. We can go to the button. So our side will have the small LCD screen. So let's set to let's say I want to set to home. Okay. Hold. Press and hold. And E. So this one, let's make it to empty. Okay, empty. Press and hold to exit. So until the bottom line here, disappear. So this one looks like for the score and fault. The next one will be the 24 second timer. So 24 second timer will be switching 24 and also 14. So you can start, you will start count. Once the timer reach, it will trigger the bell. So let's stop first, stop, and let's go to the score. So whenever to set the time, you can set the, this is the set the minute. And this is the second. So every increment will be 30 seconds. So for demonstration purpose, maybe I set 10 minutes. Once you set the time, press run. So this is the millisecond mode. So you can see that the 24 seconds still running. So this is a 24 second. 24, 14, it like switching. 
So once the time reach, it will trigger the horn. So this is how it's like. So stop, run, stop, and for reset, press and hold for reset. So this is, let's say start from two minute. You can see now the horn is running. So start again. So this is the switching. Run. 24. 14. As long as the timer keep run, then it will run. 24, 14. So the timer still counting down. So the score, everything will be controlled by this three controller. So for example, the score, because it will be connected to the different so just now we reach the 24 seconds. You can see this is the countdown timer part. So on the last 60 seconds. So this one have to and we can press fast. So this is how it looks like. So basically, it divided into three controller. One is control the 24 and 14 second shot clock. The next one will be control the name, team fault and score. The last one will be control the timer, timer setting. So now we still have 25 seconds. So whenever, whatever display over here, we can find in the small LCD screen over here also. So another 60 second. So this is how it looks like. So until the zero, it will trigger the bell. Sometimes it's quite loud also. So this is how it looks like. If you like my channel, help us to like, comment and subscribe. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.